Hey YouTube, time for an update on the shrimp tanks. Stay tuned. Hey YouTube, it's June 2017 and it's time to do an update on my uh, shrimp tanks. Um, we'll go ahead and start. Um, We'll start over on this side of the room this time. Right now you're looking at um, my red pinto tank. Got some spotted head pintos, some uh, bellies, some zebras. And uh, they're doing real good. Haven't had any breeding happening yet, but um, that, that'll come shortly, I, I've got no doubt. Um, just really happy with the way this colony's turning out as far as the way they look. Um, my first go around with pintos or red pintos and uh, you know just really happy about it up above is the blue dream tank they're doing well as you can see there's quite a nice colony of them going I wish they would breed more than they do but uh, you know they're they're doing their thing over here is the we're still gonna call them Savage Reds. Um, not a very big colony, but a colony nonetheless. They have been breeding, there are babies in the tank, and uh, the adults, where did this one, oh, you can't see from the aisles. You've got a really nice looking one up here, and a few other really nice looking ones in the tank. So, hopefully someday these guys will really breed out and uh, we can uh, get some of these available to to people out there. Royal Blue Tigers are doing okay. Um, there was some definite breeding in the past couple of months, but it doesn't seem like many of the babies have grown out. Some of them have. As you can see, there's some decent sized jubies in here, but not quite as much. Uh, is that a dead, dead one there or something? Piece of debris. It's always hard to tell from behind the camera. Anyway, um, we're going to continue to work at these and see what we can't do. Get asked about these all the time if I've got any available for sale. Answer is no right now until I can get this colony going well again, but someday. Uh, this is the red tank. I've added quite a few to this tank from from upstairs where I had that 90 gallon before that's in the process of being taken down so I've been slowly getting the shrimp out of it as you can see there's various grades in here from regular cherries to ones that could be classified as fire reds or painted fire reds um, this tank I've got a lot and would definitely be willing to sell if you're looking for reds of whatever grade we can make it happen just shoot me an email. My email will be below the video in the description area, but you can see there's tons in here. I pulled well over a hundred out of my other tank to add to this tank, and there's probably well over a hundred in here already. So that's good. Uh, crystal blacks are below. Don't have any of these ready available at this point to sell, but continuing to work with this colony hopefully that they will uh, really start breeding at some point here for me go ahead over to the other side of the room here sorry about that noise I had to move a chair the lighting is not real good on this tank because it's just covered with uh, salvinia the top but these are the the low grade a or a through s uh, crystal reds got a ton of these um, as always and uh, they they are available for sale so if you're interested in any of these shoot me an email and we can work something out um, this is the black pinto slash tie b slash few other things tank um, they're all back there right now munching on some food but I had a couple uh, buried Thai bees in here I think I found a buried Pinto 
recently, but I can't, I haven't been able to find it again, so I can't verify that for sure. But um, if that's the case, that'll make me really happy. And um, yeah, that's kind of it for that tank. I wish they were up front. I always try to put a piece of food in before I film these. And for some reason, they carried it back to the back of the tank this time. Over here are the other crystal red slash white slash golden bee tank. Um, had a couple deaths in this tank recently. I'm not sure what that's all about. But um, they're doing good. Um, a lot of babies too recently. A lot of white babies, which is something I was really hoping to do is get these, these white ones in here to breed. So hopefully uh, that continues. Found some buried females in here. Three buried white ones. Here's one of them right in front of us here. Where do you go? Or she, I'm sorry. Dang it, she swam over, oh wait. A little bit of algae on the glass so it's hard to zoom in and get a clear focus, but anyway, there it is. Next door are the PRLs, they're doing good. I'm to a point where I could sell a couple of groups of 10 of these if anyone's interested. Shoot me an email, we can work something out. Man, the blurriness, uh, there we go, we're focusing in a little better now. This colony's doing real well, really well. Over here are the super crystal reds. They're doing good. There is one buried female in here. That's not it. Uh, where is it? I can't seem to find her right now. Oh, that might be her. Yeah, I think that's her. I can't won't be able to tell until I actually watch the video on the screen, but or unless she maybe turns so I can get a better yeah, I think that's her Down here are the Taiwan B tank, the mixed Taiwan B tank, doing really well. Got some blue bolts, some red King Kongs, black King Kongs, pandas, shadow pandas, red bolts, kind of the gamut in here. Had some babies recently too, so that's always a good thing. Take you upstairs and show you the last tank, kind of the last or new addition, I should say. I got some blue bolts here, and uh, we're kind of starting a blue bolt only colony. There's like 18 of them in this tank, so. Only had them for a couple of weeks, so they're still not super active and they haven't bred or anything like that yet, but that's what I can tell you about that. So that's really about it for this month. Um, thanks for watching as always. Uh, make sure that you uh, subscribe if you're new to this channel. I do uh, updates on my shrimp tanks regularly, all my fish tanks, my cichlid tanks, and my uh, reef saltwater tanks as well. So thanks for everybody that does subscribe. Welcome everybody that's a new subscriber. And until next time, talk to you later.